All right, we're off. The wedding happened, it was fantastic. We had a great time. The Indiana people threw down uh, and uh, we threw an amazing wedding. So that's lit, we're heading off to Breckenridge. We have matching t-shirts. We'll get some pictures in a little while. So that's dope, right on. We've got our nifty little rings, rings, yes sir. <laughs> Uh, and we're off. It's a little cloudy out, a little cooler, but uh, it's only gonna get colder from here and uh, looking forward to a good road trip. Ooh. Well, we're at this uh, rest station here. Little absolute nowhere. They even have a corral for your horses. So if you're traveling long distance with your horses, you can uh, corral them here for a short time. We are literally in the middle of nowhere right now. <laughs> All right, update. We are on the Royal Gorge train. The Royal Gorge train. It's Christmas themed as well, because the holidays are coming up. So now we're gonna wait to board. We have our private little seat, which will be nice. We won't have to be with anybody else. And uh, apparently we're on the good side of the train. Whatever that means. Here we are on the train. Yay. Caitlin's taking medicine because her nose won't start running. Just like at the uh, ceremony when she wiped it on her dress. <laughs> the best part. Good and memories. I wiped it on my too. Good memories all around. <laughs> yeah, it's a beautiful home area playing lovely Christmas music we got our menus that's exciting I wish I could flip the camera around can you see me what's up Let me, let me, let me just tell the story. Uh, so we come in this, uh, by the way, we're here at the resort and we come in, it's super cute. Very, very cabiny, cabiny and cozy. We're ready to shack up. And uh, I come in and, and Caitlin's like, hey, we, let's go bring in the stuff. And I had set my car keys and everything down and I went outside and the door shut and it has an automatic lock on it. So as soon as that thing shuts, it's locked. Like there is no lock to this thing. Look. Like it, it's an automatic. So it automatically click electronic lock and both keys we're in here on the counter. And my phone. And, and Caitlin's phone. Keys. And the car was open because the window was down. Ugh. 
but we're back in. Let's get the tour. No. All right, here's the front door. We got this, here's the bed. Very cozy, it's like hotel style. TV and everything, couch. A nice little living space. Closet and me. A nice kitchen. We have a garage, but we're not allowed to use it yet. Or we don't have access to it yet. We don't know what the door is, probably storage. And a nice lovely bathroom. So it's nice and cozy. We're excited. It has a beautiful view of the mountains that we'll see in the morning. Wow, look at this view. We're a little winded right now. Look at this view. This is Hoosier Pass, the Continental Divide. It's so freaking awesome. Like just, it's so expansive. Everything's just so crazy. Every time we come out here, we find something new to find and look at. It's really awesome. How are you feeling, Caitlin? Uh, and I go, we also got to throw in a little bit of pepper chicken. LPC. LPC. Alright, we're gonna, we're gonna make our way further up. Here we go. <laughs> and here we are. Back to where we uh, got engaged. <clears throat> Excuse my voice, it's cold. This is it. If you recognize or if you saw the vlog from the last time, this is where we got engaged. This is crazy. It's so weird to be back here a year later as married people. Holy crap. Well, we uh, woke up this morning and uh, it wasn't supposed to snow, but it is snowing. As you can see, the buildup of my car there. Supposed to be a whole mountain range over there that you can't see right now. But uh, we drove, or well, I drove. And so I've already, I already slid going down this road down get to get off the mountain uh, before it was snowing. And so now that it's snowing, I think the right option is gonna be taking the bus. But uh, we'll see. Can't hardly see anything out there. It's very quiet. That's cool. <laughs> the poor car. Very nice quiet though. Well, everybody, a nice lovely stroll down Main Street. As you can see, they do have heated sidewalks, but only, only in a few places. Beautiful snow coming down. It makes things a little bit heated sidewalk. Makes things a little inconvenient, but uh, Caitlin's having a good time. My face is getting wet. <laughs> We're heading to a Columbine Cafe for breakfast, so hopefully you can get in there. Here we are in the gondola. We're not going skiing, but we do enjoy the gondola ride and getting to see the lifts and everything up top. So we're gonna head up the mountain here. Road conditions are quite nice today, as you can tell, here in Breckenridge. This is that lift that I saw a moose on last time we were here. So that's pretty cool. But yeah, we'll update you at the top. What a beautiful trip we're having here with all the little, little Christmas trees. pine trees and yeah, little, little Christmas, Christmas trees, trees everywhere. The snow is just falling so perfectly. It's a bit of my size trees. Yes. Very. There's footprints of something in there. There's footprints of something down there, yeah. Probably a Bigfoot. Probably. And we are approaching the resort. All right. Here we are. You can see how misty it gets up there. Look at that, all the clouds, all the skiers coming down. This is where we were last year and we went skiing. But we're not skiing this year, but very early season around here. But as you can see, there's still patches up there and different routes closed, but yeah, quite the happening place today. 
Fresh powder. Well, here we are. It's uh, it's about 14 degrees outside. Bright and sunny, beautiful day. A little chilly out. We're about to go to Sapphire Point and freeze our nipples off. It's gonna be a good time. It's gonna be a great time. I'm gonna wipe off the windshield with all this frost and stuff. Jeez, I'm shaking. It's so cold. Here we are. Sapphire Point. That's Caitlin. We also just found out that we have reservations now at the sold out, uh, what is it called? Briar Rose. Briar Rose Steakhouse for our Thanksgiving Look meal. <laughs> Look, at Look at this beautiful scenery. This is incredible. And your beautiful walk. Yeah. This, this, this is incredible. Wow. This place is awesome. It's got a nice little trail. I guess they're reforesting this whole area. I guess it was on fire at one point. So that's why it's all bald in places. But wow. It is a beautiful day in Breckenridge. Our last day in Breckenridge. We got our coffees, just walking around. I think we're gonna hit up the uh, Irish pub for lunch and then we'll head on our way to wherever we feel like going. <laughs> That'd be great. Sun is shining. Shorts weather. Uh, clouds in the sky. Caitlin says shorts weather, I would agree, but considering we're out here for so long, whew, trying to catch my breath up here. The altitude's kicking my butt. The yeah, my the altitude's kicking my butt. I can hardly breathe, but. We're doing all right. So I guess they light up this whole area. We were wondering why this whole area wasn't lit up the other night. Like it was last time we were here. And apparently that starts next week. And they do the running of the Santas. And all the Santas go running down Main Street. And then they light up the town, which is really cool. But we'll have to come later next time, maybe. Yeah. Oh, hey, look, it's Caitlin in rock form. <laughs> Oh goodness. Caitlin the Rock Armstrong. <laughs> this is that area that we were at last time that was all lit up and cool. It's a summer day. <laughs> it's kind of warm, yeah. There's the mountains, all the ski slopes. It has Fred in the necklace. Yeah. There you go, another bluebird uh, in her necklace. It's the mountains. It's in the mountains. Well, uh, we did it again. An amazing view. We uh, decided for the last night tonight, uh, we had to leave Breckenridge because our last day, <clears throat> excuse me, the last day of the reservation was Friday, which is today. So we had to check out. So we were like, where are we gonna stay? Well, we like Colorado Springs. So uh, Kayla found us this nice little resort and it's got a nice little balcony overlooking Pikes Peak and everything. And uh, it's a good little, little room here it's a good little room we do we do well on these trips we do very well on these trips oh oh, oh. there we go there's me so this is a little tour of our deal it's pretty nice pretty nice all right here we are the last part of our honeymoon here at Garden of the Gods in Colorado Springs. This is one of those spots that we always go to whenever we go to Colorado. Pretty cool stuff. All right, so this is like the closing remarks of the vlog. We didn't vlog everything since it was our honeymoon. We just kind of enjoyed ourselves and so whenever I remember to vlog, I would vlog. But uh, we did everything from, shoot, we went ice skating, we went ax throwing, we did all sorts of things, hiking, shopping. We did everything that we possibly could. And now I'm driving. We had some we have 40 minutes left. 
We had, okay, anyway. So we had some great food. We had the, uh, you know, the elk, the blackberry elk, as usual, so good. Um, you know, of course, we stopped by the, the Irish pub. That was awesome. Uh, the breweries, the distilleries, Garden of the Gods, as usual, we stopped through there. I believe I have some videos from that, I hope. Um, but yeah, some really cool things. And we had a great honeymoon. We had a great time in Colorado. Now it's time to get back and teach. So, all right, well, Vic Spinelli will be you. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching.